in obedience to the command of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ, and upon your profession of faith in Him, and on the authority that's given to this church, Rock Hill Baptist Church, I baptize you, my brother, in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, buried with Him in baptism, raised to walk in newness of life. Amen. This young lady was saved this morning after the service. If you remember, it was a, a great, a wonderful occasion. In obedience to the command of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ, and upon your profession of faith in Him, and upon the authority given to Rock Hill Baptist Church, I baptize you in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Buried with Him in baptism. Raised to walk in newness of life. In obedience to the command of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ, and upon your profession of faith in Him, and on the authority given to Rock Hill Baptist Church, I baptize you in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, buried with Him in baptism, raised to walk in newness of life. <laughs> Logan was saved when I was away on, uh, after I'd had surgery. I believe Brother Ben was preaching filling in for me that night, I believe, I'm not sure. But he came to know the Lord, and he was so excited when uh, I got back, he said, I'm ready to be baptized. I want to get baptized. Amen. <laughs> so in obedience to the command of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ, and upon your profession of faith in Him, and on the authority given to this church, Rock Hill Baptist Church, I baptize you in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, buried with Him in baptism. <laughs> Grace to walk in newness of life. Amen. What a wonderful, wonderful experience. Amen. Amen. I pray we can have this experience every week. Amen. So let's stand up. Let's stand up. Brother Feathers, would you pray for us and lead us in our closing prayer? And we certainly appreciate y'all being here with us today. God bless you for coming. Okay.